Hi everyone. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. I hope you. I hope this one you well. Because it's not the same for us. <laughs> we are almost dead and tired and all the things that you can imagine. So um, usually in a in a trip we take more time for some parts of the trip, but uh, this time because everything had to match in five days, um, we had to put many things in one in only one day. Um, so our day today has begun at um, 3 a.m. and then we leave to Karnak Temple. Um, we've been there a long time uh, doing the, the, the activations there. And um, then we went to a very bad option that I don't recommend at all to do uh, August 2nd in 45 degrees Celsius under the sun um, in the Temple of Mut. Uh, so don't do that. We did um, almost die because it's, it's really hot. Um, and um, also, after that, we drove to Dendera, where we we have been for hours. And after three hours driving, we just arrived to Abydos. So it's really exhausting, and we are really tired. So I would like to speak about some things that um, that kind of make a summarize of um, the information for today. Um, and it's like um, Karnak, the temple of Karnak, what we have been going through is death. So we have to integrate death, um, transcend death, face death, in order to bring all the ancestors and, and everyone that is dead um, towards um, a new level, to a transcendental level, uh, which is the resurrection. So we've been working with death, death and resurrection to transcend the concept of death. The other thing in Dendera, we work with uh, sexuality and to transcend the idea of sexuality because we have, um, as we try to transcend the concept of uh, death in in Karnak, we, we've been working with the concept of, of death um, to transcend it into life. So in Dendera was like, taking all the concept of sexuality to push it towards so we could release that tension, that energy, and then we could rise it up to what uh, is the transcendental aspect of sex, which is love. Uh, so um, it's been really hard because many of the things were um, new for me and uh, I end up really tired and also um, um, I fade out, so I think. So um, they had to help me come back. So that's why I look so tired. So um, in this uh, uh, in this day, we have faced the idea of the body um, uh, from death uh, transcending to life and from uh, sex transcending to love. And um, not as if they are opposite things like one against the other, but as um, as a complementary from the unconscious and the conscious point of view of the same thing. So what we have been doing was trying to show it up, to, um, to observe that, to acknowledge that, and try to balance that. Um, what we have done today was related to water. Um, and um, uh, in the first temple in Karnak, we've been working with the memory of the waters of the temple. There's a big pool, sacred pool in the temple. So we've been connecting with its memories and waking up uh, to remember. Um, and in the other hand, in Dendera, we've been, we've been working with water of our blood. So to awake our memories and also to feel that um, uncomfortable situations from our root chakra. So we are not all here because for some people it's already impossible to, to stand still. Um, as you see, we are very tired. And, uh, um, and of course that in um, tomorrow at uh, 
5 a.m. we visit Osirium, which is the last of our temples in the south. So tomorrow, uh, I, I tell you this now and also at the end, I guess. Uh, tomorrow, we won't meet at, at um, 10, 20 p.m. like now. We will meet at 11, 20 a.m. Okay, so it's 11, 20 a.m. Egypt time. So that makes really early in the morning for the Americas. Um, so I'm so sorry because I know that you are many there, but um, it's impossible for us because we are traveling. So at that time, we don't know if we have arrived or not uh, to our next destination in Cairo. So once at this, I remind you all that we connect today with the element water. We are clearly out of time. We concentrate in our breathings. I take deep breath, I become aware of my own body, the physical body. I become aware of my feet, my legs, genitals, hands, arms, chest, back, neck and head. Softly and slowly, I start to move all my body through every joint. Stretch all the body, yawning. Take a deep breath and become aware how the oxygen gets in my lungs and from there throughout my entire circulatory system. I perceive the heartbeat, recognizing the blood around the body and all the veins and arteria arteries all throughout the body, spreading along. Siento el pulso de cada latido, como las olas del mar. I feel the pulse of every beat towards the waves of the sea. Nice that within my body everything is made out with water. Water is the essence of my body. That the every person around is also made out 
with water. Throughout humanity in this world, I start also to acknowledge that all of us is made by water. Humanity is water. And everything that made us be what we are connect us to water. The animal kingdom the vegetal kingdom, the human kingdom, all of us are bounded by the links of water. Toda la vida es un único cuerpo acuático. All life is a unique aquatic body. And in this water, we can find the huge and biggest forces difficult to control. Las emociones, the emotions. Las emociones son como una enorme tormenta. Emotions are like this great tide that move along, showing us only those things that we want to see. I recognize that all life is water. Yo vengo del agua, y el agua vive en mí. All life comes from water, and all water is in me. But I also recognize that water is much more than only my body or the groups and life in this world. El agua es océano, niebla, nube. I can see that this body is much more than just a species. Water is the ocean, the steam, the clouds, the rain, the snow, the ice. The streams, rivers, lakes, lagoons, swamp, delta, and sea. Pero el agua es mucho más, but water is much more. I take a deep breath, recognizing that water is much more than this blue planet. And I find out that water is also in Venus and Mars, in the moons of Jupiter and Saturn, and beyond towards the galaxy. Water is in every comet and asteroid. Water populates different worlds and galaxies. El agua es lo que da sentido a la vida. Water gives a meaning to life. And if I am willing to transform my life, I have to flow like water, moving along the entire cosmos. And so for that, I have to recognize I am water. Yo soy agua. I am water. 
agua. I am water. And softly I lift myself to move like the tides, the waves on an ocean. Acknowledging what things are those that ask me to let them go, to flow. So I can expand. I take a deep breath and recognize I am water. I am water. I take a deep breath. And slowly I come back, stretching the body, yawning. 
and each one and sometime come back here and now. Thank you everybody for being here another day out of time and see you tomorrow this time at 11 20 a.m egypt time for the last alignment of our five days out of time thank you